everybody. Uh, wait a minute. Where's Luma? Hello? Luma. Well, that's odd. Where did Luma go? Hey, have you seen Luma? I woke up without my star friend. Oh, well, that's fun. I wonder what quest Luma is on. <sighs> kind of weird being by myself, though. Oh, I know. Ah, that's better. You know what I just kind of realized, though? Sir Shelly Sheldon Snails Lot the Second kind of needs his own place. Hello, Shelly. Would you like your own place now? Ah, Shelly, get all of my face. <laughs> I bet I could whip something up with the blocks that I already have. Let's see. What could we build your house out of? Do you want a blue house? I have a lot of blue blocks still. Is that a yes? Do you like the color blue? <gasps> okay. Ta-da! Oh, Shelly! Come here. There you go. <gasps> Look at him! I think he loves it. Well, anyway, last time we started working in the Blush Burrow by building a barn, a windmill, a bakery, and a villager house, which is quite a lot, actually. So we should be done with this village in no time. Let's go check out that list in the village to see what else we can fix up today. So it looks like our options are a restaurant, a grocery store, markets, or a tree farm. Hmm, the markets and tree farms sound like fun. Let's work on that today. Now our barn is over to the left. Our bakery is over there and our windmill is in the middle. So where could we put some markets in a tree farm? This spot kind of looks like a good place for a market. And, oh, who's that? Hello, what you doing? <laughs> Saplings. Oh, was this your farm? Well, I've actually agreed to restore the villages surrounding the Star Island. This is the second one that I'm fixing up. That's funny. I was actually about to work on that today. What trees did you used to grow here? Wait, you grew trees that produced ore? Like emeralds and diamonds? Oh, the ore tree guidebook. What does this say? Ore trees are special magical trees that produce various ore within the trunk of the tree. There are nine different known types. Coal, copper, diamond, emerald, gold, iron, lapis, quartz, and redstone. The trees can only grow with ore from a hidden magical location. <gasps> A magical location? Wait, to make an ore tree sapling, combine a freshly mined ore with any sapling. One of each type is enough to get a new farm started. Stop, this is so cool. I think we're about to discover a secret area. Whoa. Thank you. Guys, look at all the stuff I just got. I got another book that's called Shush. A brand new Paxel, a pickaxe, a hoe, three torches, and a trapdoor. Some of these things are a little weird, but I love the new tools. What does this Shush book say? There is a secret cave plentiful with ore not too far from the Blush Burrow. Only a few know of its location as it is quite hidden. Follow these steps and you will find what you need. Uh -huh. It's time for an adventure. Where do we go? Head toward the land where the pink trees turn orange. Oh, I think I know where that is. We should get my boat though. Hello. All right, if I go around this way, I see pink trees that turn orange. Whoa, this is pretty. But okay, what else does this book say? You should see a single spruce tree that marks the path you need to take. Okay, well, um, I see a lot of birch trees. Let's see if we can find the spruce tree though. Hello, are there any spruce trees over here? No, but there's cows. Okay, I'm not seeing anything this way, so maybe we should go this way. <gasps> oh my gosh, there's orange flowers by the orange trees. Sorry, I just thought that was really cute. Anyway, <laughs> back to tree hunting. Ooh, what's this? No, there's an enderman in there. Okay, nope, not going that way. Um. Okay. Am I blind? I don't see a spruce tree anywhere. Maybe I have to climb up this mountain more. 
Oh, there it is. Finally. Okay, the spruce tree has been discovered. Now what? Hoe the dirt beside the tree to find a switch. Ooh, that sounds secretive and cool. This kind of looks like an entrance to somewhere. I bet it opens. But wait, let's see. Hoe the dirt. <gasps> oh. Oh, <gasps> cool. But wait, how am I supposed to... Eh. How am I supposed to get inside of this? Oh, wait, is that... is? Is that why he gave me a trap door? <laughs> Wait, can I do this? Aha! Uh -huh. <gasps> yes, I made it in the secret tunnel. This is so cool. Look at all the purple stuff in here. Okay, I assume I just keep walking this way, right? I just gotta, gotta follow this tunnel. Does the book say anything about the tunnel? All it says is at the end of the path, you will see a forest lush with purple amethyst trees and overgrown vines. Okay. <gasps> Oh, I see sunlight. I see the purple forest. Oh, that's so pretty. Okay, but um, can't get out of here because I, I already used my trap door before. Um, oh wait, there's switches here. One, two, three, four. <gasps> oh, that is so cool. Whoa, look at this place. Those trees look so pretty. Oh my gosh, look at this area. All the vines, stop it. This is so cute. But okay, um, from what the book said, I think I'm supposed to be looking for like a heavily overgrown vined area. So let's see. Um, there's vines everywhere. Uh, how do I know if I'm in the right spot? Oh, this looks kind of cool. <gasps> Hello? What? What? What is this? What? Why are there so many buttons in here? Hold on. You're in the right place if you see a small cave with three blocks missing in the wall. Place three torches where the block should go and find the button to open the door. Be careful which button you choose to press. What? Th that's the only info I have? No direction to which button I meant to press? Also, what does it mean to be careful? Um, <laughs> okay, now I'm scared of these, but I think this is the right place. That's a wall with three blocks missing. And I assume that these are the torches I'm meant to place there. Um, one, two, three. And now I just have to press the right button. <gasps> okay. Is it this one? No, this one. No. 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 <gasps> ah! The button spawned in a bunch of zombies! Stop, 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 stop. No. Please not. No, no, no. Bye, bye, see ya. Okay, that was not cool. Well, I don't like that button. Ah, wait, ah, there's another one. Get out of here. Stupid. Okay, yes, this is the no button. Do not touch this one, bad, no. Uh, <laughs> okay, let's, uh, let's go over here. How about this one? No? Okay. Uh, no, no, no. Ah! Which button is it? What about this one by the torch? Nope. Ah! This is impossible! How am I supposed to know which is the right button? Ah, I must touch them all. Okay. <gasps> Hello? <laughs> I think I found the right one. Hello, you. Okay, but why does it open and close so fast? Hello? Oh, that's scary. Um, <laughs> okay. So, do you think I'm gonna suffocate or do you think I'll make it? For everyone, I should be able to do it, right? <laughs> Run! Oh, I did it! Am I meant to go down this waterfall? Oh, yep. Oh, okay. Are those blocks of diamonds? Wait, I'm gonna freak out. This is so cool. Oh my gosh. This cave has everything. Do you see this? There's diamonds right here. Gold, redstone. <laughs> I know why this is a secret now. This is so cool. This place is incredible. I can't believe something like this exists. But okay, back to the book. We need nine types of ore. Coal, copper, diamond, emerald, gold, iron, lapis, quartz, and redstone. Okay, there's coal right here. 
One of these. Where's the copper at? Uh, there it is. Copper, diamonds, emeralds. Then we need gold. Here it is. Oh, there's even more gold up there. Uh, but we have that. We need a piece of iron. Oh, hello. Thank you. Some quartz and some redstone. We did it. All nine ores have been mined. Let's go bring these home. Guys, I was in my boat and being attacked. What is this? Stop. Stop. I, am I gonna die? I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm dying. Something's happening. I didn't like that. What are bad? Where did I get off my boat? Well, whoop, I'm risking it. I'm risking it. I'm risking it. My boat didn't even keep me safe. A unicorn boat failed me. Ah! Okay, what? This stop. Why is everything attacking me right now? I do not appreciate. No. Oh. 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 Okay. Yeah, a lot is going on. A lot is happening. I just want my stuff. I mined so many ores and I would like them back. Where did they go? Oh, this is bad. This is bad. I don't know where my stuff is. I, I literally don't know where my stuff is. Is it this way? Where's my boat? I need to find. Ah, I see it. Ah. Okay. Okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Where's my boat? Did the thing eat my boat? <gasps> oh, my Luma plush is safe. Oh, good. Oof. Um, but, okay, wait. Let me, you, eel meat, disgusting. Get out of my inventory. Do I have everything? Coal, lapis, redstone. I'm missing something. Wait, what am I missing? What am I missing? Which one? Oh, quartz. I'm missing the quartz piece. <gasps> I need that special piece of quartz. Oh, got it. Well, that was a bit stressful. <laughs> okay, I think I have everything except my boat. Where is my boat? I would like it back. Ah, oh, here it is. I'm sailing back home. Okay, <laughs> now that I'm not being chased or attacked anymore. Do I have any saplings? I'm gonna need nine of them. No, 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 no. Really? Wait, what about my backpack? Really? I don't have any saplings. Okay, okay. It's okay. It's okay. We take the tree axe uh, and we're gonna go chop down some trees. <gasps> sapling, sapling, sapling! I need two more. Oh! Hello. One more. Ooh! Okay. I think we're good. Now, according to this book, all I have to do now is combine the saplings I just got with the ores that I mined from the secret cave. So if I just go to the crafting table, and put one spruce sapling in with a diamond. I get a diamond tree sapling! <gasps> oh, stop, look at this. That's so cool. Okay, wait, we have to make the rest of them. Sapling, gold. Huh? <gasps> Maybe I need to smelt it. Wait, 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 wait. Smelt it, smelt it, smelt it, smelt it. Thank you. Okay, now will it work? Sapling. Gold. Oh, that is so fun. Okay, wait. Sapling, emerald, redstone, lapis, coal, quartz. And then I think I also need to smelt the iron and the copper, right? Yup. Okay. Smell, 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 smell. Woo! I did it. Look at all my cool magical ore trees. We should go bring this over to the guy in the blush burrow. Hey, I found the secret place and I made all nine ore saplings. Whoa, thank you for that. Oh, oh, that's pretty neat. Okay, let's build, plant the trees and then bone meal them to see what happens. Are you serious? 
Guys, this is the coolest thing I've ever seen. But also, look at the cute tree farm area. So cute. We love it. Besides that, look at the trees. All of the ore just grew inside of it. I feel like we should chop one of these down. You know, for science. Do you think a tree axe will work on these trees? I mean, I guess there's only one way to find out. <gasps> Stop. It just gives me logs full of diamonds. Huh, do I put this in a furnace? Wait, backpack, furnace, coal. He ho ho <gasps> I do. No way, this is awesome. But I'm gonna be good and replant the tree. There you go. Are you serious? Thank you! Guys, I get free access to the ore tree farm. This will definitely be helpful in the future. But okay, I'm gonna let that grow and go work on the markets. Now this is the spot that I mentioned liking earlier for the markets, but that sign didn't specify how many markets to build. Looking at the area, if I just chop down a couple of trees, I should be able to fit about three. Let's do that. How cute are these? Also, look at this. We can make actual crates to put produce in. I think we should make a bunch of these, set them up on the market counters, and fill them up with the crops grown around the windmill. Right now we have beetroots, onions, green beans, and wheat, but I kinda wanna get two more things. Let's see. I got it. I'm gonna buy some melon seeds and pepper seeds. First, we should probably make some room for these new seeds by picking up these. How do I harvest you? Oh, so let's take some of these onions. Then we'll take some green beans. That way we have space to plant our peppers and our melons. <gasps> you know what I just remembered? That guy made a bone meal machine. I'm just gonna take some of this. That way we can get these crops growing. Pepper. <gasps> Cute. Oh my gosh. Now will the melons grow? <gasps> Aww, it only goes to the stem. Okay, we'll have to wait for those. Oh, oh, nice. What about you? Will you grow? No. Those will have to wait on for a bit. In the meantime, I'm gonna go collect the rest of these crops. All right, I got the crops. Now it's time to make the crates. Oh, wait a minute. I left my crafting table over by the tree farm. There. Okay, so all we need to make the crates are some fences and some slabs. So if I just add fences on top with slabs in the middle, I'll get crates. Let's do five per market. Look at this, this is adorable, but I can't just leave them empty. Let's add all the crops that we picked. We could have this market selling melons and peppers, the market stall in the middle can sell onions and green beans, and this market can sell wheat and beetroots. Ah. These are so cute, but I can't stare at vegetables all day. While we're over here, we should probably make one more villager house. Ta-da! Wow, what an adventure. Can't believe we got to explore a secret cave today. I also can't believe we technically have endless access to money and gems now. Well, anyway, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, and if you're new, make sure to subscribe.